And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And our live coverage comes to you from League Two. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4-5-1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. The starting 11 for Cheers, Jeff. And this confrontation is underway. Well taken away, he won the ball. And it's back now with Steele. Can he take advantage? A smart stop here. How about the short corner? And the cross into the middle. Not the best clearance. Far from a good pass. Well, as we look at the table, the visitors Derek, have been... this dashed. could be a goal here. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Well, the referee well aware that he had to blow his whistle. And on comes the physio. Following that stoppage, the referee will restart the game with a drop ball. Hassan, clean challenge. And space to cross it. Well, tremendous block. And the counter-attack is on, options available. Well, it could be on for him here. Couldn't quite hang on. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. So close to getting that early goal there, but it was a wonderful save by the keeper, you have to say. Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by stringing a few passes together. Well, he's given it away. The 
the supporters want to see him have a go. And he did what he had to do defensively. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Garner. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent. So what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, he's their top mark. Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they he deservedly hold the advantage. Well Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. One nil then. Daly. O'Connor. And a strong tackle. Samaras. Opportunity it is. Oh, wonderful save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Corner kick played in. Well, the danger is still there. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Great pressure to win the ball back. Now, goal news to bring you from one of the other games. Here's Alex Scott with the details. It's a goal for Colchester United. They've scored the opener with 28 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Into the advanced position. He could pick out a teammate. Nicely timed tackle. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Two. Williamson. Nearly at the break then, and the visitors have eked out a lead. Stuart, an opportune moment, I think, to get your assessment. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Still looking to get the shot off. Cleared away comprehensively. And a goal has gone in in one of the other matches. Alex Scott will tell us more. Yeah, it's a goal for Mansfield Town. They've scored the opener here with 38 Alex, minutes Alex, sorry play. to interject, but a big chance here. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that?
This attack looks highly promising. Can he put it in? Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. And possibilities inside the box. And there it is, the half-time whistle. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead. So into the second half and cheers Jeff looking to build upon a positive first half performance. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Now they stop them in their tracks. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. But the danger averted for now. And room to roam for Cheers Jeff on the wing. That's a useful cross. Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, very effective play in possession. Well, let's see about the cross. Well, the flag has gone up. He could have been in business. Well, it's so frustrating. It's good work on the flank, but he's got to do better to keep on side. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Samaras and an astute piece of defending chance to attack using wit he's got to clatter it away can they do something positive on the counter attack and the referee blows for a foul Bullock. Can he take the chance? He's foiled them on his own. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in one of the other games, and Alex Scott can fill us in. It's a goal for Warsaw. The score's level again now at 1 1 with 60 minutes on the clock. Cheers, Alex. Might be able to get in behind the defence. It did look on for them, but not to be. Marvellous piece of skill. Jack Muldoon. Oh, it might be! Good stop from the keeper. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. taken short very quick thinking there well it was a risky challenge but brilliantly executed Hassan this is looking threatening And Harrogate with the ball again. 
Now the situation has changed in one of the other games I'm hearing. Let's go to Alex Scott. Yeah, it's a goal for Leighton Orient. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 20 minutes left on the clock. Thank you, Alex. Armstrong. Now he must favour the cross. The supporters want to see him have a go. Must score! Nicely saved. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. And they're making a change. Keen to take it short here. And crossed in there. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Another chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Who can he pick out? Well, he made great contact with that one. But the goalkeeper had his own ideas. And behind it's gone for a corner. And short it is. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? In the short corner, let's see. Textbook goalkeeping. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Well, they fancy a short one. Just ten minutes remaining here. Now, I believe changing circumstances in one of the other games. Alex Scott will tell us more. Yep, it's a goal for Northampton Town. The shot was ferocious and it went in off the woodwork. They're now behind by one with 82 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. That'll be a Harrogate Town throw in. How can they find a late leveller? Luke Armstrong. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, deemed to be offside by the nearest of margins. Well, it's very close to being the perfectly timed run. But whether it's an inch or a yard, he's still offside. Well, when you can keep the ball like this, it's got to be really annoying for the opposition. It's with Garner. Oh, that's a fine pass. Two nil now and back underway. And a big chunk of added time here, a minimum of five minutes. It might be on for them. He's in behind. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss.
And Grant now. Luke Armstrong. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, there goes the final whistle, and it's all gone to plan for the visiting fans. Three points for them. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a great performance. And I think it's fair to say there was plenty to like about his performance in this match. Well, that was an average performance by him and his teammates. They just never got going. He can certainly play better than this. We'd like to ask you some questions about the match. No further questions, thank you. Gaga, come on, come on. We each took a knock on a cookie, crack on a cookie, and I'm going to go.